Greetings lovelies, hi it's Emmy, welcome back. Today I'll be eating a fruit. I hope to make this as an ongoing series of just new fruits to me, new tropical fruits. It doesn't have to be tropical necessarily, but just fruits that I've never tried before. So today I have a dragon fruit. So dragon fruit, these beautiful fruits that are pink and they have these kind of green sepals and they grow in tropical areas. And this will be my first taste of it. So let's see what's inside. I'm going to cut this lengthwise and look at that inside. Isn't it gorgeous? Here's the other half. Beautiful. It's gorgeous. I don't want to eat it. It's so beautiful. And I believe one of the candies that I had from Papa Bubble. Have you seen that video? If you haven't seen that video, I'll point you down to the description box where I'll put the link down below. And Papa Bubble created a really unique, fun candy, and I believe it was dragon fruit flavor because it had this interesting kind of color combination. Very scoopable. It kind of reminds me of basil seed drink, too. If you haven't seen that video, I'll put that link down below. But these beautiful suspended seeds. But that's a drink. Can't say I smell anything. All right, let's give it a taste. Here we go. Mitsuraki Mmm. And an actually very subtle flavor, very mild, light flavor, fun texture. It's kind of crunchy because of the seeds. It reminds me a lot of kiwi or strawberries for that matter because of the crunchiness of the seeds. Or if you have chia seed pudding and you have the crunchy seeds, same kind of texture. But the flavor is really mild and subtle, not really strong at all. Just a slight sweetness, maybe a slight kind of floral flavor. Surprisingly, for all its ornamental beautifulness, it doesn't have that much of a flavor. Just a slight sweetness, but delightful. Gorgeous, gorgeous fruit. So I bought this at H Mart, and it was just a couple dollars uh, for one fruit. I think it was three forty-nine a pound. They were on sale, so I got them. They're sort of rare, but when you see them, you can't, you can't miss them. So, yeah, I definitely recommend trying one out. The flavor is kind of hmm, but they're just so gorgeous, and texturally, they're really fun. So, yeah, give it a go. Eat your dragon fruit. And in terms of its health benefits, I'm not really sure, but it's a fruit, so it's probably better for you than, I imagine, than most things. So let me know in the comments below if you've ever had dragon fruit before and what you think of it. Or let me a comment and let me know what fruits you'd like me to eat so I can make a list and look for them. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I hope you guys learned something, and I'll see you in my next video. Toodaloo, take care, bye. He also sent me a note with a little picture of me. Cute. <laughs> Let's start with Mr. N's favorite, Fufru. And they're jelly fruit candies and all different kinds of flavors. Oh, they smell great. It smells a bit like gummy worms. Dragon fruit, dragon fruit, dragon fruit.